A pleasant day to all. Good morning. Good afternoon. Or should I say, good evening. Hello my Mac friends. It's Emmy again. I am your Mac and Soft Daddy DIY. It's been a while my friends. Do you miss me? Do you miss your daddy? Well I am now here. For you baby. And for today's video, I will show you. How to create a USB Mac OS Monterey 12.4 installer media. Using of course our GUI app. Open call legacy patches 0.4.5. And without any further ado, let's start now. Using this GUI app for making a USB OS installer it's just easy. First thing first, you will need a 16GB USB flash drive. Then you are good to go. Follow Emmy this tutorial it's easy. Just read all the prompts, guides that will appear here on your desk screen, and follow. OCLP made this fast and easy for all users. Creating the installer, with open core legacy patcher, our new GUI includes, a download menu for macOS installers. So to start off, you'll want to grab our app. We'll be using the standard open core patcher GUI. After downloading the package and once the OCLP finished, installing the install assistant PKG into applications folder, a prompt appears. OSA script needs administrator privileges to ADD install assistant and asking our password. Then type Eaton Baby. Click OK. Installing install assistant package. Prompt says finished extracting to applications folder. Then wait until the indication line, filled with blue, click, the box flash installer. Select macOS installer, installers, found in applications folder is, 12.421F71, yes we click that box. Then a prompt appears. Format USB. Selected USB will be erased. Please back up your data. Missing drive ensure they're 14 gigabytes plus and removable. Then, click your disk to USB 3.0 of 16 gigabytes. Click it. Creating installer. Install Mac OS Monterey. Formatting and flashing installer drive. First insert a 16 GB USB flash drive to the USB port hub. Developer note creating macOS installers can take 30 minutes plus on slower USB drives. That's why we highly recommend that are using a 3.0 USB flash drive. Because the read and write is much faster than the ordinary drives. We will notify you when it's done. Please do not close this window until the bytes are written. However, a prompt says, OCLP helper wants to make changes. Then it will ask for our administry password. Enter your password to allow this. Type it in. And now, Bytes is now written. Wait off until it's written. Finished running installer creation script. We have successfully. Created the Mac OS installer. Would you like to continue and install? Open core to this disk. Onto the USB flash drive. OK then click. Install open core to disk. As you can see the difference of 0.4.5. To 0.4.4 success prompts. Now you can see that 0.4.5 is automatically. Building and injecting open core directly to our flash drive. With no hassle. A less stress for more users. That's another beauty and excellency of this patcher. Now your open core EFI has been built and says finished building your open core configuration. Would you like to install? And yes, click the box. Install to disk. And wait again for just a couple of minutes while the system is looking and scanning for a device or devices that is connected to our Mac. In other words, it is looking for the flash drive. And it's running. Prompt says. Select disk to install open core onto. Loading disks shortly. Then choose the correct disk. That appeared here as usual. Click the flash drive. Click disk 2 you can see. It's indicated. 
a USB disk 3.0. Click it. Now select partition to install. Open core on 2. Click EFI 209.7 megabytes. Then enter your password, of course. There it goes our EFI appears, and created. Copying open core on 2 EFI partition, adding, external USB drive icon, cleaning, install location, unmounting, EFI partition, open core transfer complete, thank you it's almost done, baby, and finally we have to reboot our, machine to apply, prompt says, open core has finished installing, to disk. You will need to reboot and hold the option key, and select open core boot EFI, option, then restart our machine. Thank you, again, for this, wonderful time, sparing your precious time with me, and if you and your friends happen to like this video, give a thumbs up make it color blue, slap the bell icon, give us a like, comment, and, subscribe. Thanks for watching this video, once again. This is your Mac and Soft Daddy DIY, saying, peace, God bless, and ADDIOS, adios.